Walk on the tears, world. Walk on the tears, world. Got my four boys with me, and we about to see the world. Walk on the tears, world. Walk on the tears, world. I got four boys with me, and they about to see the world. I got Jeremiah Kaiser Cairo and Zion. Jeremiah Kaiser Cairo and Zion. Jeremiah Kaiser Cairo and Zion. Walk on the tears, world. Walk on the tears, world. I got my four boys with me by the sea of world. Walk on the tears, world. Walk on the tears, world. I got my four boys with me. Everybody see the world. Yeah, everybody see the world. Walk on the tears, world. Like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe. First impression, you OPN. We should be closer than friends. If you OPN, engaging you's on my agenda. Request my chariot, get ya. The doors OPN, take the hot road and hop in. First impression, you OPN. We should be closer than friends. If you OPN, engaging you's on my agenda. Request my chariot, get ya. The doors OPN, take the hot road and hop in. First impression, you OPN. We should be closer than friends. If you OPN, engaging you's on my agenda. Request my chariot, get ya. The doors OPN, take the hot road and hop in. Monarch butterflies, you should open up. I'm trying to put your heart together, found it broken up. Going up and smoking, smoking up. Make sure the children in the house, she's inappropriate. The way she's approaching us, I disassociate. Exfoliate, the renegotiate. She's closing up. Come to visit me, she said that she the loneliest. And it's hard to open up. Open you up like a pokeball. Open up. Tear you out for a pokeball. Let your emotions fall, fall on me. Open up. Open up. Open you up like a punk ball. Open up. Tear you out for a punk ball. Let your emotions walk fall on me. Open up. Open up. Need to deep breathe hard and complications. Open up, you OPN, bitch you won't be BM, we should be closer than friends, if you OPN, engaging you's on my agenda, request my chariot to get ya, the doors OPN, take that hot road and hop in, you OPN, bitch you won't be BM, we should be closer than friends, if you OPN, Engaging you's on my agenda Request my chariot to get ya The doors OPN Take the hot road and hop in Open up Open up Shut it down like a Macintosh Open up Open up OPN OPN Cold as ice and Coca-Cola Open up What's up y'all it's your girl tia and i'm back with another video okay as y'all can see in this title so yes i am pregnant and i wanted to share with you guys early 
because I wanted to vlog just how I'm feeling and just this whole pregnancy excuse me instead of doing it later on kind of just you know for those moms that are new moms or just um moms again and just want to see different people situations and what they go through and updates i wanted to be um that you know i want to do my videos like that so every video is not going to be just about pregnancy but you know just updating you guys and filling you guys in early if you guys don't know me my, my, my name is tia i'm a mom of four boys jeremiah kaiser zion cairo and kaiser sorry um i just got back from the doctors and i know i'm pregnant already i knew early on i am currently nine weeks and a day they said today i am um still in this phone call um so yeah here is the sonogram i don't know if it will put too much up there does it doesn't have these don't have my name on it mm -mm. it just has the hospital but uh I'll zoom out. There it is. Whatever it is. It is real. Um. So, yeah. So, I just came over. I just pulled over. Oh, I'm almost in my house now. I just found the Chick-fil-A because I just want to eat something. And that was the first thing that came to my mind. Look at this big old bird. I don't know if it's a turkey or what. I'm really, really nauseous. She gave me a prescription for nausea. Um, so I'm gonna go pick that up before I go home. I have to open these windows. I feel so nauseous. Um, that's why I just said I was gonna pull over and eat something. Because I know once I get in the house with the kids, I get distracted with dealing with them. And then I forget to eat, like, right away. And I don't want to feel worse than what I do now. So I pulled over. I got me some chicken like I got me just the eight pieces. I guess my face has been breaking out. I have been feeling like crap. Today is the first day I actually, like, did my hair threw some lashes on and i still look tired but it's all good um it's just how i feel this pregnancy so far is kicking my butt like kicking my butt but god is good um i know you guys have so many questions i'll save that for another video but i just wanted to just let you guys know that um, yes, it is true. I am pregnant with baby number five. Um, I, I already did all the whole complaining and I can't believe this happened. I did all that. Um, if you guys don't have anything positive to say, please stay out of my, stay off my channel. Um, I just don't want that energy. I don't, I just don't, I don't need it. I already had that energy and i just prayed about it and um i let it go so um yes it's the same dad so all my kids have the same dad in case you guys are wondering um so i'm just gonna go ahead and eat my food i guess i am gonna film myself eating i i already cleaned my hands i wish i had some extra wipes in here or something but i don't i'm gonna put y'all right here um, I still have my hospital, 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 because I just literally had to get out of there and I go to the whole building. I only had an eight piece, I should have got 12, but it's all good. It's really tiny. And here are the nuggets. And the fries. I got fries. They're a large fry and a large lemonade. Me. I got some um buffalo zesty buffalo sauce, so good. And I got some Chick-fil-A sauce. So I can really take this hospital bracelet off, but I'm too I'm just ready to eat. Um what has been going on? Y'all, I have been so sick. I guess this video was gonna be a vlog, but I guess it'll just be a announcement pregnancy announcement i don't know pregnancy announcement slash mukbang slash how i'm feeling symptoms and so forth um so let's put this in the middle of here how am i feeling i've been feeling horrible 
Like, I kid you not. I've been feeling really, really sick, really, really weak, really, really tired. Like, sometimes I don't even, I don't like dealing with the kids. And got my mom, she's been taking the older ones and visiting my family and stuff like that. So I'm still with the two little ones in the house during the day. And when they literally take a nap, I don't even realize I go to sleep. And I literally, as soon as they close their eyes, I'm asleep. And I'm like, I only sleep for about like 30 minutes. But I don't even be feeling myself full of sleep. Like, um... If I'm craving something, I'll go out and cook it and prepare it and buy everything. And once I'm done cooking, I'm nauseous. I have no appetite for it. It makes me so sick. I can't even eat it until the next day. So every day, I've been craving something, make it or get it. And then when I have it, I'm so sick. Like, I can't even smell it. The smell bothers me to the point where I'm just like, I don't even want it. Like... It just goes to waste. I give it to the kids. I give it away. Or I eat it the next morning. Um, and it's been like that every day. No matter what. I'm only eating once a day. And I'm snacking like on oranges. Literally, this is, oranges are like the only thing that I can keep down. And that helps me with my nausea. Like literally, I took it with me to the doctor's. Cause I didn't want to feel queasy in there. They're literally like the only thing that I could like keep down or eat and feel like, oh, I feel like human again. So I told her how I feel. She gave me a prescription for nausea medicine. I'm not going to take it cause I don't really like taking medicine, especially during while I'm pregnant ever. I don't care if they say I can take it or not. I have to be in like, really, I have to really, 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 really be out of it or sick or something to take something into my body um while i'm pregnant so i do i don't even do it when i'm not pregnant so i'm gonna hold off i'm gonna pick it up i'm gonna hold off on taking it but i'm gonna have at least i'll have it in the house so when i'm to the point where i can't do anything because that's how i've been i've been like i can't even move like all i want to do is just lay on the couch once I feed the kids and give them everything that they need and, you know, situate them, bathe them in the morning. I usually wake up, we all, they all take their baths, um, dress them for the day, make their breakfast, I'm back on the couch. I get up, um, I'll clean up a little bit, back on the couch. They'll play, mess up, whatever. I'm just on the couch, just laying there, letting them just play, watch their movies or whatever. And then I'm like, just out of it because I just, that's how I feel. Everything bothers me. I'm not trying to complain, but this pregnancy hit me the worst, and I I know that for a fact. Um, other than that, seeing the sonogram today made me uh, just more accepting to it. Seeing the actual baby move this early and just it's just it just put me in a whole nother perspective put the whole situation in a whole nother light for me because I was down I was upset I was kind of like just like sad and stuff like that but not sad about the baby just sad because the situation with their dad and then the situation as far as um you know just being in a better situation you know I plan I, I said I wouldn't mind having a fifth kid once I have my house and stuff like that but you know, when you don't do what you're supposed to do, these are the results. So, um, I'm 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 good now. I'm in a better space now, honestly. At first, even though I'm still like tired and stuff like that, but I'm in a better space mentally with the with the accepting the fact that this is real, and I'll be having a kid in seven months. So, what else? another kid in seven months 
boy or girl you guys know that i want a girl um i'm praying that it's a girl i'm manifesting that it's a girl all pink dust and all pinkish and but i'm okay if it's not i'm okay like i won't be like you know like i'm okay i have four what's one more you know one more boy so I, i'm okay if it's not I'm not gonna be like one of those parents that'll be like crying and stuff. I'm not gonna cry. No. But um either way, as long as my baby is healthy, happy, and safe, I'll be I'm fine. So that's pretty much it. I'm talking more than I'm eating, y'all. But um I'm not full, but I'm kinda like, yeah. Mm. I'm gonna finish eating. I gotta run to the grocery store and get the kids some milk. Some juice. I think I'm gonna make some chicken alfredo for dinner because they really like it. And I I made it the other day. It was so so good. So that's what I'm gonna do. And um yeah, I'll keep you guys posted and thanks for watching. Make sure you guys comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.